350 in Ramakrishna Mission Book Shloka number 30 Karoti Karma Kriyate Chajantuhu Kenapya Saucho Diti Kenapya Saucho Dita Anipatatam Natatra vidvan prakruta sthito pim Nivrutra trishna swamukha nubhutyam Swasukha nubhutyam Lord Krishna talking very deeply, elaborately about a wise person, how he or she maintains their mindset, <coughs> mental arena, how they maintain in spite of doing day-to-day -day routine actions. that is very useful for all other seekers as in Bhagavad Gita we saw Yani Chitapragnasya Lakshanani Tani Mumukshoho Sadhanani What are all the characteristics are there for a Jnani? The characteristics of a Jnani becomes a means to a seeker. Jnani sthita pragnasya lakshanani or gunatitasya lakshanani or parabhakta lakshanani tani mukshoho sadhanani bhavanti. So these slokas are very very useful for every sadhaka. Even in Bhagavad Gita, Lord Krishna did not explain this much elaborately. As a jnani knows that I am the Sakshi Chaitanyam, the sentient principle enlivening this body, I am independent of this body. Body belongs to Vyavaharika Satyam. I, the Sakshi Chaitanyam, belongs to Paramarthika Satyam. I am of the nature of eternal peace. I am the nature of eternal happiness and I am the nature of eternal security. The Anatma Nama Rupa body mind complex depending upon me for its existence. Jnani knows that. All Nama Rupa belongs to Maya they are existing because of me. I lend existence to them. I lend sentiency to the body-mind complex. I enlivens the body-mind. At the same time, <coughs> I am not affected by the body-mind. Even though I enliven the body-mind, I am not affected by the 
afflictions of uh, the body mind all the afflictions happens in the anatma body mind <clears throat> upon which i have no control i the atma i am just an observer happening what are all happening in the body mind the moment i remember this my life is a sport as i am remembering this truth my life is like a leela like a sport like a game i am playing a role like an actor just like an actor i am playing the role i am not uh, affected by any of these uh, body afflictions mind afflictions ragadvesha jara marana vyadhi really speaking i am ever free atma this understanding is called moksha this understanding is called liberation the moment i forget this truth the moment i forget this truth i attach to the body mind anatma my life is a struggle burden some boredom miserable mbbs mbbs means what life is a miserable boredom burdensome and struggle when i forget this truth forgetting means when i lose sight of this truth when i don't claim this and i claim the body mind life is miserable therefore life is miserable or sport is in whose hand bhagwan has given shastra vedanta guru everything bhagwan has given um advaita vasana also because of lot of punya we all have got um this much advaita vasana this is also not easy to get uh, um interest in this atma gnanam advaita gnanam it is ascharyam in the teacher who is speaking is also ascharyam the listener you all are also ascharyam wonder it's a great wonder therefore our realm of thinking itself is a different realm agnanis cannot understand that because to come to this level how much we have worked inside at intellectual level with the help of shastra and guru we only can know nobody can know others even family members your dear close near nobody knows you are thirsty you alone can know if you are hungry you alone can know if your stomach is full you alone can know like that when you are having this vision you alone can know that nobody knows nobody need not know i am having you know thirst i have to appease my thirst i have to eat my food not others i need not tell others all the time i am hungry 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 i am thirsty thirsty you know no use similarly i am having problems i am having problems so what is the use of saying everybody is having their own problems if i say they will not come second time <laughs> they will not talk to me because this lady always telling about her problems only therefore let me not mingle with her therefore everyone has got their own disturbances that's what lord krishna said in the above shloka kuyoginaha ye vihitantaraye there are some people kuyoginaha means a gnana yogi who is obstructed by lot of obstacles 
lot of obstacles that person what do they do they should not go back to again price chitta karma etc ishwara anugraha deva advait pumsam advaita vasana by ishwara anugraha you have come to vedanta you are not able to understand because of so many obstacles are there for that lord krishna said in second line manushya bhuta devatas devatas also cause obstacles through your family relations your family relation relations are related people are not uh, uh, really the cause your prarabdha brings them their own instruments through them your prarabdha is exhausting otherwise how will you get vairagya every pain every sorrow is only to bring vairagyam in you detachment in you then only you will come get attachment to shastra many people after getting lot of uh, kicks in their life then alone they look forward bhagavad gita but some people only manushyana sahasreshu kashtiti yatati siddhaye without any problems seeing the others problems also wise people viveki they come to vedanta okay that is said in the above shloka he should not go back to again karma kanda he or she should again listen to shastra shravanam instead of doing prayasitta karmas in this 30th shloka he says jentuhu the ordinary human being not repeating the shravanam manano again the some ordinary human beings what they do lot of karma karoti prayasitta karmas they do they won't come to shastra guru and all because there is no ishwara anugraha for them why ishwara anugraha is not there they have not done any ishwara preeti karma <laughs> why they have not done ishwara preeti karma because of selfishness <laughs> because of uh, attachment raga dvesha they never do ishwara preetyartham karma because of that ishwara anugraha also they cannot get uh, kamahi tai tai nara because of those who desires they do lot of karmas prapadyante janaha lord krishna said in bhagavad gita and people do lot of rituals only to get some fulfillment of their desires kena apya sau chodita ani patat until death there are some people until death kriyate to get that phalam of those karmas kena something or other some actions hmm, by unseen swabhava vasanas kena api asau chodita chodita means purusha pursued by persuaded by kenapi chodita persuaded by some unseen um, characteristics of a person anipatat until death until death the ordinary human beings jentuhu nar ordinary human beings are called jentuhu becoming a karta bhokta they continue but whereas a vidwan here vidwan means an informed person who is a gnana yogi implementing the shravana manana vidhyasana sadhana tatra na prakritau sthitopi nivrutra drishnah bhavati 
विद्वान एन इंटेलिजेंट पर्सन हु कम टू शास्त्र एंड हु स्टडी इस शास्त्र विथ सो मच इंटरेस्ट विथ सो मच इंटरेस्ट हु स्टडी शास्त्र दैट पर्सन वाट दी डज ही इज नाट बॉदरिंग अबउट प्रकृत स्थित मीन्स इन स्पैट आफ् रिमेनिंग इन दिस बाडी मैंड कांप्लेक्स विच ईज मेड अवट आफ् प्रकृति प्रकृत स्थित मीन्स रिमेनिंग इन दॉडी स्टिल दिस इंटेलिजेंट पर्सन लाइक आल आफ यू यू आर् आल इंटेलिजेंट निवृत्त तृष्ण फ्री फ्रम तृष्ण डिजायर्स स्थूल शरीर प्रकृति मीन स्थूल शरीर स्थित अभी निवृत्त मीन डिटैच फ्रम आल अनात्मकर्मा निवृत्तृष्ण डिटैच फ्रम आल अनात्मकर्मा मीन विच आर् मेटीरियलिस्टिक विच आर् बिलांग टू बॉडी मैंड कांप्लेक्स how he is able to do that or how she is able to do that hmm? vidwan by claiming i am sukha swasukhanu bhutya means by claiming he is our her own ananda swarupam swasukha means bimbananda i am of the nature of eternal happiness not aya ram gaya ram happiness coming and going happiness coming and going happiness is because of putra putri car house all are coming and going ananda but i the atma is bimbananda reflecting in every pratibimba ananda ई दि बिंबानंद आनंद स्वरूप आत्मा नेवर हैव एनी ग्रेडेशन हैप्पी हैप्पीयर हैप्पीएस्ट नो मोद प्रिय मोद प्रमोद आर् नाट दैर ई एम सुखस्वूप स्वसुखाभूत बै क्लेमिंग हिज ओन सच्चिदानंद स्वरूप सो ऐ हेव टू लुक एट मै सेलफ इन दट श्लोक हाँ ज्ञानी इज सो वंडरफुल ज्ञानी हेज गाट ज्ञान ज्ञानी इज एंजॉयिंग दट लाइक दट इफ यू गो ऑन टेलिंग हौ लांग यू से ज्ञानी ज्ञानी दट ज्ञानी दट ज्ञानी नो लुक यू लुक एट युअर सेलफ यू आर् इन दट थर्टीएत् श्लोक Lord Krishna talking about me only, like that we should feel, fake it and make it. Yeah, act. Just to you act, one day or other you will become that. <laughs> so fake it and make it. Up to here, we saw in the last class. Next shloka and the next page three hundred and fifty one. वर्ष नंबर थ्री थर्टी वन ठंत व्रजत शयान मुक्षत मदंत मन स्वभाव स्वभाव आत्मस्थमतिर्न वेद continuing the same topic all are excellent verses pashyan shrunvan sprashan jigran that shloka similar shloka this is this gnani atmastham atihi atmastham ati means atmastham atihi yasya sah the person who is remaining in atma swarupam in atma swarupam that is my real nature 
आत्मस्थमति ही हुज माइंड इज एंटरटेनिंग दैट नॉलेज आई एम साक्षी चैतन्य आई एम एवर फ्री आई एम नॉट एफेक्टेड बाय बॉडी माइंड दैट पर्सन आत्मस्थमति ही न आत्मानम वेदा हियर आत्मानम मींस फोर्थ लाइन सेकंड वर्ड फर्स्ट वर्ड आत्मानम मींस शरीरम बॉडी आत्मानम न वेदा ही डजंट बॉडर अबाउट द बॉडी बॉडी इज गिविंग लॉट ऑफ पेन्स सम इट इज गो ऑन एंड changing its shape uh, one day nice another day okay another day okay <laughs> no, like that from toe to knee toe to head one problem or other anything any time it can happen to the body that's why shiryamanam swabhavah shariraah दहन योग्य देह सो दिस टाइप ऑफ बॉडी अनफ्रजल बॉडी अनप्रेडिक्टबल बॉडी कंडीशन इज अनप्रेडिक्टबल एट वाट एज वाट टाइप ऑफ प्रॉब्लम कम्स नो बड़ी नोस नो बड़ी नोस वी आर एक्सपेक्टिंग इट विल बी गुड बट वेन इट कम्स ओनली मई गाड वै इट हेज कम शोलडर पेन नी पेन लेग पेन और बैक पेन एद वै नी पेन कम्स बिकाज नी सार देर देर फोर नी पेन कम्स वै हेड पेन कम्स हेड एक हेड इज देर देर फोर हेड एक कम्स स्टमक पेन स्टमक इज देर देर फोर स्टमक पेन कम्स आल विल नाट कम एट ए टाइम वन आफ्टर दि अदर समाइम्स दे विल कम एंड डिस्टर्ब so all these are natural to the body atmanam na veda means here he does not know it is not the meaning na veda means he doesn't not give much focus or bother my leg paining 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 he won't go on telling others some people always talk about their problems problems means and they were family problems so obsessed they cannot resist themselves and they want some victim to burst out my daughter in law is like this my son in law is like this my neighbor is like this go on and on mind is so feel comfortable when i burst out my problems caused by some other people i mistake really problems are not caused by anyone our own buddhi our own misconception is the cause for our own problem as puja swami ji says uh, you are the problem you are the solution problem is you solution is you but we don't accept because of so and so person my mind is disturbed because of so and so incident my mind is disturbed uh, why that much weak mind we are having we never question ourselves but we always point out on others a intelligent person never point out others he accept his own mind anyhow atmanam na veda means not bothered or not obsessed because of body disturbances or bodily actions bodily movements what are all those functions of the body tishthantam when body is standing hmm? i am standing from long time i am standing from long time and <laughs> go on too much obsessed i have no place to sit i am standing so stand what to do that is your prarabdha nishtantam uh, asinam sitting while sitting standing sitting 
ఆసీనం ఉత వ్రజంతం ఆర్ మూవింగ్ వాకింగ్ వ్రజంతం సంబాడీ కెనాట్ బి ఇన్ ఆల్వేస్ సిట్టింగ్ పొజిషన్ బాడీ కెనాట్ వాక్ ఆల్ ద టైమ్ ఇఫ్ యూ గో అండ్ పీపుల్ గో టు శబరిమలై వైష్ణవి దేవి అండ్ దే వాక్ ఆఫ్టర్వర్డ్స్ యూ సీ దేర్ లెగ్స్ హౌ మచ్ ఇట్ కా ఫోర్ ఫైవ్ డేస్ ఇట్ విల్ టేక్ తిరువణ్ణామలై గిరివలయం ఆఫ్టర్ వాకింగ్ ఫోర్టీన్ కిలోమీటర్స్ నో స్వాధీనం ఇన్ ద బాడీ ప్రజంతం యూ కెనాట్ సిట్ ఆల్ ద టైమ్ యూ కెనాట్ వాక్ ఆల్ ద టైమ్ you cannot move all the time so body does lot of functions sitting standing walking etc not only that reclining shayanam reclining condition function of the body kshantam excretions also uh, urine motion all excretions are going on those functions if they won't take <laughs> excretions are not taking place and uh, you will be in icu <laughs> డాక్టర్ విల్ సే ఐసియు థ్యాంక్ గాడ్ ఆల్ దోస్ ఫంక్షన్స్ ఆర్ గోయింగ్ ఆన్ ఉక్షంతం అన్నం అదంతం వాట్ హ్యూమన్ బీయింగ్ డూ ఇన్పుట్ అండ్ అవుట్పుట్ ఇన్పుట్ అండ్ అవుట్పుట్ ఆఫ్టర్ అవుట్పుట్ ఎగెయిన్ ఇన్పుట్ ఇన్పుట్ అన్న టేకింగ్ ఫుడ్ ఈటింగ్ అన్నం అన్నం ఆర్ ఎనీ అదర్ ఫుడ్ చపాతి ఎనీథింగ్ విచ్ ఆర్ ఈటబుల్స్ ఓకే ఆల్ ఆఫ్ దెమ్ స్వభావం అన్యత్ కిమపి ఈహమానం బై న్యాచురల్లీ సమ్ అదర్ ఫంక్షన్స్ ఆర్ ఆల్సో డన్ బై ద బాడీ స్వభావం మీన్స్ న్యాచురల్లీ సమ్ ఫంక్షన్స్ ఆఫ్ ద బాడీ డన్ ఈహమానం అని ఎంగేజ్డ్ ఇన్ బాడీ ఈస్ ఎంగేజ్డ్ ఇన్ ఎవ్రీ డే ఆల్ దిస్ నో బడీ కెన్ అవాయిడ్ ఓకే even they avoid few hours they can avoid not all the time so what even then he is engaged in all of them like a singer musician while singing he sings raga he knows what raga is singing and sahityam also lyric also he knows he is singing and taalam all are there ragas three hours concert ragas are changing taalam changing lyric also changing he cannot sing the same lyric like na some gramophone record olden days when we were young some gramophone records will be there when the pin is you uh, know old pin same place that uh, gramophone record will stop and the same word is go on and on and coming uh, a singer cannot do that so raga sar changing lyric changing taalam changing but one is not changing shruti so he is always keeping align with the shruti like that here also vedantin in spite of all these functions of the body going on so what body upadhi i am not a human being with the spiritual uh, principle in the body i am not like that i am a spiritual being with an incidental body i am not a human being with a, a spirit <laughs> i am a spiritual being with a human incidental human body therefore this person uh, accept all of them ihamanam atmanam na veda so what chalta hai body has got you know, don't look at the outside body as you are aging hair color changing wrinkles are coming and the people bother about their teeth my god and the teeth uh, attachment one, one or two goes out uh, the face will change its shape and uh, they look at a gross minded people look at other people also gross body only how they are looking you know Uh, gross minded people a subtle minded people look at their intellect their mind subtle minded people but a vedantin 
never bother about their physical appearance other people's physical appearance other people's emotions or intellect so what why i have to bother about them let me how i am what am i doing what am i thinking how am i living spiritual being i am with this incidental body na veda <laughs> he is not much bothered okay hair care nail care tooth care eye care skin care so however much you do care it will change parinama will be there so that's a accept to the old age accept your um, white hair accept your um, uh, mouth without teeth also accept your ears without hearing power also accept your eyes defective eyes also what to do hmm? why you don't ask that is the nature of the body that is called maturity as you are growing you are maturing grow out of that attachment from the body make use of the body say tata bye bye nah. i am not obsessed with that so it is nice shloka okay next one 32 yadism pashyet yasadindriyartham nananumane na viruddham anyat nam namanyate vastutaya manishim swapnam yathothaya nitirodhanam yadi even a person is he anga sorry anga illa he uddhava yadi a person is indriyartham asadindriyartham pashyati asma asadindriyartham means the objects of sense organs which are false not uh, judgmental objects when i see why this is like this why this is like this it's a very difficult task accepting the people as they are accepting the things as they are but human mind as it has got attachment why this person behave like this why this object is like this why this is not like this judgmental that is called judgmental the more you are judgmental with regard to your own personality with others and other things also your life is so miserable the more judgmental you are the more uh, miserable never be judgmental in anatma vishaya asadindriyartham the objects of sense organs they are all um, not steady they are all false only limited asadindriyanam finite limited there are four descriptions of uh, the universe are given here all the objects of sense organs whatever i see it is object of my perception object of rupa perception means shabda rupa shabda rupa rasa shabda sparsha rupa rasa gandha all of them they are all um, pashyati a person who sees them which are the sense objects as asat limited finite number 1 this is the description number 1 nature of the universe nana pluralistic how many names are there how many forms are there can you count we cannot count innumerable uncountable my god you cannot even imagine in the world there are so many objects so many forms <laughs> nana anumanena through logic 
you cannot comprehend anumanena the sense organs um, gives uh, pluralistic um, pluralistic perception no no there are lot of things uh, and see the difference also sense organs asadindriyartham why they are asat why they are limited why they are finite na uh, simple ears are knowing the sound eyes are knowing the forms nose is knowing the smell all of them they are knowing you are telling all are different 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 now in high advanced vedanta grandhas this is discussed how you are talking nana so many na because there are difference differences book is not pen pen is not book it is different book is different from pen mobile phone is different from the book different therefore i am seeing them different differently they are different nana multiplic multiplied and are multiple there are so many are there na we ask a question shastra is telling are you see really seeing the difference are you really seeing the difference which sense are gan seeing the difference eyes are seeing the forms ears are perceiving the only sound nose is perceiving the smell tongue is perceiving perceiving means it knowing taste skin is knowing the touch difference is known by whom difference is known by eyes or ears or nose or skin or tongue difference can never be known by any sense organ they are only meant for shabda sparsha roopa rasa gandha not bheda but we are unintelligently make use of this word i see the differences sanna hey difference angada than form e kadiyad difference doesn't have a form difference doesn't have a sound difference doesn't have a taste difference bheda doesn't have a, a touch bheda doesn't have a smell through which sense organ you come to know the bheda tell me we never think like this you know shastra make us to think therefore what you are seeing all this difference nana asadindri artham the difference you are seeing therefore that is a plurality you are telling nana many things are there why na each one is different from the other how do you know which sense organ reported you na false <laughs> is the mithya na okay think pandi parungo romba mind boggling statement bheda can never be known by any sense organ even by the mind what mind knows whatever sense organs gives the report only mind knows mind cannot know anything separately whatever sense organs pratyakshana or anumana it reports to the mind mind come to conclusion plurality how do you know sense organs perceived how the sense organs perceived they cannot perceive the bheda shabda sparsha roopa rasa gandha only they perceive ask any sense organ have you seen the bheda na no 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 i have not seen the bheda but then why you are telling ask your sense organ it closes its mouth i <laughs> cannot answer that is why krishna paramatma says asat indriyartham nana anumanena through logic also you cannot arrive at this is why uh, whole world is mithya when we say it is mysterious you can never arrive this world is there the world is not there you can never say it is sadasad vilakshanam anirvachaniyam so therefore you cannot prove the difference because inference based on pratyaksham 
So pratyakshan itself difference you cannot prove. Even can anumana can prove. Anumana inference based on pratyaksha. Pratyaksha itself cannot prove the difference. Plurality. Uh, how can the anumana pramanam logic or reasoning can prove anumanena world cannot be proved by logic or enquiry anumana means enquiry logic just as a dreamer in dream talks about the dream world as real just as a dreamer talks about the dream in the dream as real. Correct only. For a dreamer, dream is not a dream. Dreamer talks about the dream as real in the dream. When he talks about unreal, when he wakes up. When he wakes up only he can talk about the dream as unreal. Similarly, as long as you are in Atma Ajnanam, you talk about the world reality, plurality, utility, variety, beauty, all are <laughs> As long as you are in dream, that's what Krishna Paramatma says. So see the next line. Namanyate Vastutaya Manishi. Manishi means a jnani. Manisha asya asti iti manishi, the one who has got wisdom. Vastutaya, real. It is not as real to disturb human. Vastutaya na manyade. He does not uh, look at them as real. It is only an appearance. Just as what? Swapnam yatha Uthaya, when uh, just as a dreamer, when he wakes up, Uthaya, Tirodhadhanam, the dream which is projected by the, his own mind, it will disappear. It will disappear. So, similarly, like that, Tirodhadhanam, just as the dream disappear when a person wakes up. Similarly, when a wise person wakes up to his own nature, Prabodha Samaye, in Dashina Murti Stotram, Pragaswap Samiti Prabodha Samaye, Yapratya Vignayate, Tasmai Shri Guru Murtaye Namayidam, Manishi Swapram Yatha Uthaye, from the dream when he wakes up, Tirodhadhanam, just as it disappears similarly, this whole world is also disappears. No, it continues, but uh, reality disappears. The Satyatvam in the world disappears. The world continues after knowledge also. Thank God. <laughs> world continues. That is the difference between Swapna Prapancha and Jagrat Prapancha. Once you wake up from the sleep, uh, the dream goes away. You realize that dream is unreal. Similarly, when you wake up to your real nature, Atma Jnanam, you get uh, the world continues, world won't disappear. But the reality of the duality in your mind disappears. The reality until today you are giving the reality to the plurality of the world, that disappears. Not the world. World let it continue. If it continues it is wonderful, beautiful. Why it has to disappear? I have taken out the uh, fangs of the cobra. <laughs> fangs of the cobra means that cobra is so beautiful, dances. It will not harm. Similarly, the whole world is like an abharanam for a jnani. Just as the na nagendra hara yatrilochanaya, the serpent is an ha 
an ornament like a necklace shiva is so beautiful no? uh, whenever we look at shiva we look at the snake it is a rubber snake a real snake it is moving or not we all look at the snake avarike ennamo adu pidikom everybody wear manga mala chandraharam indraharam he is wearing the sarpam serpent what a beautiful alankara that's why ahankara is a alankara for a gnani very nice to talk and listen to implement also <laughs> okay next verse 33 evam grihitam guna karma chitraim chitram agnanam atmanya vivittam manga nivartate tat punarikshayev na grihyate na api visrujya atma atma is neither taken or discarded <laughs> just like a body gunas and its effects morning to till night you see the mind is changing body is changing hunger thirst <laughs> you feel morning hungry am i eating then afternoon again lunch 12 o'clock hunger eat and food again after few hours again hunger again eaten like that thirst and all these are fluctuations guna karma chitram purvam grihitam jnanat purvam all these gunas and their effects is very very important shloka before getting knowledge before going to gnana yoga before going to vedanta study hmm? guna karma chitram grihitam all um, these actions done by body mind is of a unique nature of the body mind agnanam atmani aviviktam agnanam before going to get vedanta gnanam advaita gnanam what i saw guna karma chitram and all this guna guneshu vartante iti matvana sajjate people take them as real before nanya gune bhyakartaram gune bhyaparam vetti na atma is free from all gunas 14th chapter we saw at the time of ignorance body mind i thrown upon myself <laughs> i thrown upon myself then after knowledge i just <clears throat> throw them as anatma that is said here before knowledge i like elephant put mud upon its body after bath i also um i also taken body old age as my old age body disease as my disease body pain as my pain i take and polam varadhan solluvalle tamil la polam varadhi go on murmuring murmuring why body like this why like this why 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 no end for that <laughs> by that time decades will complete one decade two decade decade anna 10 years appa idu munnadi bhagat vedanta vanda nanna irundirkume anna munnadi vanda nanna irundirkume kimahagum sadhuna karavam kimahagum paapam karavam iti inda guilt hurt feeling idellame guna karma chitram grihitam purvam agnanam because of self ignorance atmani nar aviviktam atmani nar that atma which is always distinct from the body you cannot mix up and mess up 
because it is asanga can you have attachment with the space embrace the space try you cannot embrace the space why it is formless can you hit the space no you cannot make the space wet no you cannot burn the space no space itself cannot be done anything what to talk of atma i the self atma i am avivikta ha na separate hmm. independent different as though it is together in the body as though anga he uddhava निवर्तते तत् पुनरीक्षयैव पुनः तत् मीन्स दिस् बॉडी मैंड कॉम्प्लेक्स पुनः ईक्षया एव बै रईट नॉलेज ईक्षण मीन्स हियर रईट नॉलेज आफ्टर नॉलेज पुनः ईक्षया एव बै रईट नॉलेज अलोन निवर्तते हि विल turn away from anatma or anatma attachment he gives back to anatma whatever he has taken superimposed bodily my mental emotional intellectual limitations all he has taken as his or her own and he give back them to anatma body mind complex <coughs> निवर्तते हि टर्न्स अवे न गृह्यते नापि विसृज्य आत्मा आय दि आत्मा नेदर टेकन नॉर गिवन अप बट बॉडी माइंड ऑल आर आई हैव टेकन एज माय सेल्फ देयरफॉर आई हैव टू गिव अप आय दि आत्मा आई कैन नेवर बी टेकन आर आई कैन नेवर बी गिवन अप i the atma can never be given up because i the atma i am substratum it is not a thing to be given up it is not a thing to be taken either physically or mentally all this is possible only with the body mind complex making use of the body mind complex and say i am not the body mind complex then why you are using body mind complex to say to claim i am free atma i make use of body mind complex so what i enjoy ennude joy i enjoy what enjoy my glory my vibhuti as krishna said in bhagavad gita rasoham apsukaunte ya prabhasmi shishi surya yo shesi surya chandra surya the brightness the light in them is myself nasatra suryo bhati na chandra tarakam the brightness in the sun is myself the brightness in the moon myself the water taste in the water i am the smell in the earth i am and everything i am my vibhuti my glory maya doesn't have any vibhuti glory maya doesn't have any glory of its own maya is also my glory only therefore gnani ke whole universe is nandana vanam nar brindavanam polama nange brindavanam appa kedarnath ide kedarnath i the atma is all pervading who are all seeing kedarnath i am only seeing through them who are all seeing with brindavan i am only seeing through them brindavanam hmm? gnani is everywhere so everywhere that is why triptaha uh, triptaha it is said in the above shloka um what it is said trishna rahitaha he is free from vigata trishna under in one body na 
இந்த தேர்ட்டியத் வேர்ஸ் லாஸ்டில் நிவர்த்த திருஷ்ணாகன்னார் எப்படி ஞானிக்கு ஹவு ஆல் டிசைர்ஸ் வில் கோ என்ன சிம்பிள் நிவர்த்த திருஷ்ணா மீன்ஸ் திருஷ்ணா கம்ஸ் ஓன்லி இன் ஒன் பாடி இஃப் ஐ ஆம் பாடி திருஷ்ணா கம்ஸ் இஃப் ஐ ரெக்கக்னைஸ் ஐ ஆம் இன் ஆல் பாடிஸ் இன் எவ்ரி படி இன் எவ்ரி பாடி ஐ டோன்ட் ஹாவ் எனி திருஷ்ணா ஐ டோன்ட் லேக் எனி திங் ஐ ஆம் ஹேவிங் எவ்ரி திங் தட்ஸ் வை ஜானி இஸ் விகித திருஷ்ணா ஆல் ஃபேம் நேம் எவ்ரி திங் இன் த கிரியேஷன் இஸ் மை விபூர்த்தி என்ன வண்டர்ஃபுல் வரி மை க்ளோரி ஓன்லி கிருஷ்ணா டாக்கிங் எவ்ரி ஒன்ஸ் க்ளோரி எவ்ரி ஒன்ஸ் க்ளோரி என்ன மை க்ளோரி ஆர் நாட் மை க்ளோரி ஆல்சோ தட் இஸ் வாட் ந கிருஷ்யத்தே நாபி விசிருஜ ஆத்மா ஆத்மா கேன் நெவர் பி கிவன் அப் கேன் நெவர் பி டேக்கன் அப் நெக்ஸ்ட் வேர்ஸ் ஐ வில் இன்ட்ரடியூஸ் வேர்ஸ் நம்பர் தேர்ட்டி ஃபோர் பேஜ் நம்பர் த்ரீ ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் ஃபிஃப்டி டூ யதாஹிபானு ருதயோச்சுஷா தமோனி ஹன்யான்னு ஹன்யாத்தமிஸ்ரம் புருஷி ஜஸ்ட் ஆஸ் பானோருதயே பானோருதயே சன்ரைஸ் டேக்ஸ் அவே தமஹ தி வெயில் ஆஃப் டார்க்னஸ் சன்ரைஸ் காம்ஸ் வாட் இட் டஸ் இட் டேக்ஸ் அவே த darkness from the from our eyes ruchakshusham from our eyes when sunrise comes we don't see the darkness our eyes won't see the darkness so it is said sun has taken the darkness from our eyes means we see the light we don't see the darkness no more darkness appears where sun comes like that nihanyat natu sad dvidhatte they cannot create but does not create anything it is not created anything just taken are removing the darkness what it has done anything nothing happened there nothing happened there like that he compares again this is drishtanta dashtanta comes later that we will see in the next class om purnamada purnamidam purnat purnamudachyate பூர்ணய பூர்ணமாய பூர்ணமேவாசிஷாந்திஷாந்திஷாந்திஹிஹிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷிஷி